Good evening. The future of the biggest out-of-town shopping centre here in the southwest is under the spotlight tonight after one of its owners revealed they were likely to go into administration. Into is the UK's biggest shopping centre group and along with two other firms owns Bristol's Cribs Causeway. Sangeeta Lal is live outside Cribs for us this evening. Sangeeta, this will be very worrying news there for staff. Yeah, John T, it's yet another blow on the retail industry that's been so hard hit during the coronavirus pandemic. Now, bosses I've spoken to here today say there will be job losses, but they'll be minimal. No indication on numbers just yet, but there'll be in administrative roles or back office roles. So no suggestion shops or this shopping centre will close. Now, Cribs Causeway has around 150 stores and outside of a pandemic welcomes around 12 million people every year, which changed overnight when the lockdown started, when most shops were forced to close. Now, the government said it would try to support companies the best it could with things like uh, furlough schemes and back bounce back loans. But Rishi Sunak said that there would be some businesses that couldn't be saved, especially ones facing problems before the pandemic, which Into were facing. In 2019, they announced around £2 billion pounds worth of losses. And now the question is, how much of an impact will Into situation have on this shopping centre? I'm sure Cribs will survive, so maybe a restructuring of Into or maybe Into um, passes on to something else. But you can't see, you know, those, those major sort of anchor tenants of Marks and Spencer's and John Lewis would be putting lots of pressure on to get that, that Cribs causeway open again. So hopefully it'll be resolved. Well, as restrictions continue to be eased and shops begin to reopen, uh, the message from government has been to support our high streets, especially when online giants like Amazon, whose warehouse isn't far from here, have been best placed to benefit from the lockdown. But it seems people do still feel shopping centres like Cribs Causeway play an important role, but one now that may have to evolve. Covid gives us an opportunity to be able to reassess our values around like the commercialisation of these kind of areas and who gets priority and who gets dibs on which spots. The appeal is always there just to sit at home, not bother to go out, um, but sometimes there are items which you really do need to get eyes on in the shops. Welcome comments there, no doubt, for the other two companies that still run Cribs Causeway, who say they're deeply saddened by what's happened with Into, but say it will not mean shops here close, nor that the shopping centre is under threat. So it seems here business is uh, it's business as usual. Sangeet Alal, thank you.